ओके सो हाय एंड वेलकम टू द एट डेज ऑनलाइन ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम ऑन गूगल आर्थ इंजीन फॉर रिमोट सेंसिंग एनालिसिस ऑलरेडी वी कंप्लीट आवर फर्स्ट टू फिफ्थ नंबर ऑफ लेक्चर सो दिस इज आवर सिक्स नंबर ऑफ क्लास सो आई एम ए कोर्स कोऑर्डिनेटर एंड दिस इज आवर टोटल कोर्स आइटम so already uh, i mentioned all of the things about my google art in beginners to advanced course that's why i skip this part and this is our uh, total course item okay so now i will try to show our six days course content okay so six days course item so uh, in this time you see here uh, six days uh, course first item is how to make land use land cover lulc mapping using machine learning method or algorithm okay so how you can easily make land uh, land use land cover classification map using machine learning method in google earth engine platform uh, by using sentinel data set or landsat data set or modis ready made data set and all about the data set okay all of the da data set we will try uh, step by step so don't worry about this so then how to make land use land cover classification chart time series chart okay how to make land use land cover classification time series chart and uh, also you can uh, uh, you can download time series data then calculating land use land cover classification area all of the area suppose in your uh, land use land cover classification map suppose uh, as an example you select your four item or five item uh, so, uh, four um, class or five class suppose uh, vegetation build up water body barren land agricultural land or other things okay so how you can easily calculate land use land cover classification area okay every class we will go to the our lulc here you see the example map of land use land cover classification here you see the water indicate the uh, uh, blue color build up indicate the red color vegetation indicate the green color or this type of color and ban land indicate the uh, yellow color this is our one lulc example map year of 2020 uh, this is uh, one district of our Bangladesh. So, this is our land use <coughs> land cover uh, classification chart. Okay, with area. Okay, with area. After some time, we will learn all the things. Okay, so already example one code uh, already I put here. So, it's not a big deal. So, this is our another uh, uh, LULC from ready made data set. Okay, ESA data set or globe uh, cover. Okay lots of ready-made data set available uh, between different time frame so we uh, we learn all of the okay no networking issue so sorry for that because in uh, select region weather condition is uh, rainy uh, rainy weather okay so first of all we select our study area okay from our asset suppose randomly i select we uh, in this time we learn supervise okay we, we uh, supervise land use land cover classification method okay so first of all we randomly we select any small or big suppose we uh, select any small region of okay randomly we select the dhaka city okay so and put the variable name is ry you can use any variable name no problem so then we uh, now we use here the show our this uh, study area in our map layer map sorry okay map dot add layer map dot add layer function object name we select ry we want to uh, see our study area in our layer okay so now we put here the map dot center object function for center focusing
ओके सेंटर ऑब्जेक्ट फंक्शन फॉर सेंटर फोकसिंग एंड वी सेंड फोकस वी ऑब्जेक्ट नेम इज स्टडी एरिया ज़ूम लेवल सपोर्ट इज द टेन एंड नॉट इंपोर्टेंट थिंग्स ना क्लिक द रन सो नाउ यू यू सी ही इजीली आवर स्टडी एरिया ओके दिस आवर स्टडी एरिया वी यूज फॉर लैंड यूज एंड कवर क्लासिफिकेशन ओके सो नाउ वी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल नाउ वी रैंडमली सिलेक्ट वन डाटा सेट इफ यू वन यू कैन यूज सेंटिनल और मोडिस रेडीमेड डाटा सेट और लैंड सेट डाटा सेट सो दैट्स व्हाई लैंड सेट डाटा सेट इज 30 मीटर रेजोल्यूशन and sentinel data set is uh, 10 meter resolution so suppose in this time we easily select the our land set data set okay in this time we uh, use uh, randomly we use land set data set so wait a minute is a net maybe networking issue oh my god Okay, so now we see the land set nine data set also available from year two thousand eight to two one. If you want, you can use this uh, land set nine data set, and also if you want, you can use land set eight data set. So we la use land set eight data set for a large scale time frame. Okay, because that's why land set eight start from year two thousand thirteen. Okay, so maybe networking issues. So sorry for that. Wait a minute. Okay. Okay. So here is the surface reflecting data set and top atmosphere reflecting data set. We randomly select top atmospheric reflectance or surface reflectance. It's not a big deal. If you want, you can use uh, surface reflectance data set. Just here is the this surface reflectance means uh, surface reflect uh, images uh, satellite sensor capture. and top atmospheric that means satellite sensor directly captured from atmosphere okay so okay here you see the uh, already we learned from um, all of this uh, data set land set eight collection to tier one top atmospheric reflectance data set available time year 2013 to present time data set provider all of the band combination of this data set and also description of the data set in its properties all of the thing will all already will learn so now we simply copy collect our things in snapchat simply copy and paste in our code editor okay so paste in our paste in our code editor and take a variable name suppose land set 8 if you want you can use any variable name no problem land set 8 for better understanding i use the land set 8 okay so now we filter it okay suppose take a variable variable name is image you can use any variable name no problem suppose we randomly we use the image and call our whole image uh, collection of this land set eight data set okay if you ch want to check here you see the more than 1.8 million images from this uh, available in this data set from more than 1.8 million images we filter these images by uh, using our specific time frame specific our study area okay so all of the things so now we use the filter bounds function filter bounds function we use uh, for filter our geometry so simply copy our what is our geometry geometry is r y okay then we call uh, suppose we use the filter metadata also metadata metadata what is our filter metadata uh, metadata sorry metadata name operator and value okay now we check in our image properties in metadata is our cloud cover okay cloud cover land cloud cover so we use at the cloud cover for better result okay so cloud cover we use at the suppose operator we select less than okay less than suppose 1% okay so then we if you want to check how many image av available 
uh, in your study area using uh, filter study area and using mirror data less than one percent last we simply copy this uh, pre use the print function and use size function okay size function so as a integer number or round figure number value 67 images available in your study in our study area they are less than one person images then we use the filter date function okay for your specific uh, date okay or specific time frame so start date and end date so this data set available time already i mentioned year 2013 to present time so if you want you can use any time frame suppose randomly i select uh, suppose year of 2000 uh, year of 2000 suppose 17 if you want you can use any time frame between uh, this data set uh, data set available time okay year of 2017 first january to suppose year of 2017 31st december okay if you want you select your specific time frame now we want how many images available between this time frame one year only we select one year so now you see the only six images available six images is very good images because we use at the um, cloud cover less than one okay less than one that means no uh, uh no haze particle or cloud particle available in filtered images okay between this time frame one year time frame only six images av available uh, cloud cover less than one percent in our study area okay so then we from okay if you want to see this Im uh, these images filtered images simply copy and paste in our layer name now we uh, want to see this total six total six images okay so here is we we did not see because we did not use any uh, cliff function so that's why this so as a six styles images okay these six style images one is above another one is above another here six styles of images available okay so after some time we will clip this uh, six uh, study area and see okay so from this six styles of images we make a median composite one median composite images for better analysis okay so we use the median function for make a median composite image dot median okay dot median composite image when you may use median composite it automatically make only one that's why size function is not working so now you click the run you see here the size, uh, size image dot size is not a function that's why we remove size function from here okay okay so now we click the run so now you see from six or uh, six tiles of images now we see only one tiles of images median composite image we see here okay so then we clip our study area suppose we use the clip function for clipping our study area now click the run all wait a minute images okay so after some time we uh, okay what clip okay what is our clip clip our study area clip our uh, geometry uh, geometry is our study area now click the run so when you click the run you see here uh, only our study area images okay only our study area clip but we see here the black coloring because we did not set any visualization so that's why from uh, all of the band okay if you want to check if you want to check suppose print function and print this one median composite images because we use the median function and make a median composite images from six images okay so now click to the run so now you see here all of the 17 band 
all of the 17 available band of this data set attached in our filtered images okay 0 b1 b2 b3 b4 b5 g0 indicate the first item and 16 indicate the uh, 17th item okay all of the band available so now uh, already we clip our study area now we select our band combination okay uh, see it okay so now console up okay now you see here this area class area okay so uh, this sense the water body show as a this green color or uh, this type of color indicate the this uh, type of uh, this uh, hector area okay hector area this is hector and this is our not our uh, uh, this is our vegetation area less number of this is our build up area because build up you see here the uh, word is build up and uh, another one is band land but show as a different sign because we use another uh, sign because water is right but we vegetation we want to see as a green and band land show as a yellow and build up show as a red but you see here the different right so we change it now we change it okay now we change it so don't worry about this so now we use here the external option okay external function now we put here the suppose set options function so wait a minute set options that means set how you see the time uh, chart is generating okay now we see the x12 value that means blue indicate the water body show as a 1140 hectare and this is the vegetation show as a green color 7659 hectare and build up area show as a 17101 hectare and band land indicate the 300 sorry 3990 hectare and also you show as a map title is dhaka city and you will see map of your seven okay and this horizontal axis show as a area okay horizontal axis show as a area and vertical axis show as a classes or if you want to change it suppose you want to change this class name okay let's click to the again run you see this um uh, you will see map chart wait a minute okay wait a minute now you see here the all of the information of this here uh, this is our so as a class name right and these I show as a value, hector area, horizontal axis, vertical axis, uh, map title, and also water body indicate that this symbol, vegetation, this symbol will. Or if you want to download as a image format, that means your PNG, download PNG, also as well as download CSV file in your data. Okay, just to uh, open your CSV. <coughs> Sorry. You see the water what are this value vegetation this value build up this value and band and this value okay all of the things of this llc analysis okay so now if you want to uh, make now if you uh, want to make this uh, map in your uh, llc map okay this llc map make in 